The roll cast is magical. It can get you out of trouble, especially when you're backed up against trees and bushes and have no room for an aerial back cast. And it is a slow motion version of every forward cast you will ever make. Let me introduce you to the roll cast. If you had only one fly casting technique and it was a roll cast, you can catch fish without knowing how to do any difficult casts. It's most famously known for being the technique you use when you're backed against trees and bushes and can't make an aerial back cast. So you can start, if you've never cast before, you throw the fly in the water. Then you can take line off the reel. That line will pass through and you will end up with a little messy looking line on the water. I'm just going to raise the rod. I'm going to tilt it to the right and I'm going to bring the fly line back into what I call a D shape. The rod is the shaft of the D and the belly line is the rest. And then we just hesitate until that line comes back and we've kept the line in the water. And now we're going to start with our hand thumb at far end level in an open wrist position, 45 degrees. And our first move is going to be a loading move to 90 degrees from the target area. And then a power snap. Now, let me do it again. A loading move from your shoulder to 90 to the target and a power snap. Lift, tilt, hesitate, line up your elbow with your target area. First move, second move, and you're fishing. Usually when we do a roll cast, we're unrolling the line right on the water. So we are aiming our thumb a little below the target to make it go there. If we want to unroll the line above the water to present a dry fly, for instance, then you go to the target and we'll unroll above and then land. And you could even use it if you wanted a slack leader cast and unroll very high up and then let it fall. So there are times when the wind is blowing from your rod hand side and then you, you must change to a backhand cast. So you would change your feet so your right foot is forward. Again, lift, bring it back slowly, tilt the rod so your elbow would be out and your hand still comes to your forehead level, everything is the same. And, but line up your elbow with your target, do a loading move, and a power snap. Lift, tilt, position, stop, loading move, and power snap. The other time that you would use that would be if you were in a river and the, and the line was all curled up to the left of center of your body, then you would again use a backhand cast.